Hi everyone, this is Renee and I am going to show you how amazing the foundation is. I have blotchy, acne-ridden skin and once I started using this foundation, it stays on all day and it makes my skin look completely 100 million times better than it did. So what I'm going to do is I start with my Touch Skin Perfecting concealer and I dab just a little bit under the corners of my eyes kind of pops your eyes um, and I also did put on my uplift eye serum um, I dab a little on my lips and then for step two you can already see how good it blends in and my foundation my Mineral Touch Liquid Foundation. This stuff is amazing. I just do one, two, three little dots on my face. You can blend it with a makeup brush. I prefer my fingers, the brush God gave me. And you just kind of blend it in, smooth it out nice and even. And voila, flawless skin. This will stay on all day. Once my foundation's on, I then work on my lips. I do not leave my house unless I have on mascara and lipstick. I like the Unique Precision Liner Pencil, of course, in red. See how easy that glides right on and I like to mix this with several different colors. I could tone it down with one of my lighter brown lipsticks. If I'm going out at night, I will make it pop with, say, my Swanky Opulence lipstick, and that really makes the red pop. Um, next is my Moonstruck Stiff Upper Lip Stain, of course, in red. And this stuff stays on all day. With this, you put on the first coat and you let it dry and then you apply the second coat. So while I let that dry, I work on my eyes. For my eyes, since I'm always in a hurry, those of you that are moms totally get this. I like using my Moonstruck Addiction palettes. I love these palettes. What I do is just simply get a little bit of Smitten. Kind of rub it over my lid. Um, you kind of even everything out and give it like a good base. And then I get my navy blue, which is precarious, uh, precision eyeliner. I just put a little bit on the top, a little bit underneath. And because I have brown eyes, this precarious color works really well for my brown eyes and makes them stand out a little more. I will post a picture of what colors work best for your eye color and your skin pigments and skin tones to help you choose the colors that best work for you. Um, after I put on my eyeliner, sorry I keep looking down, I do not have an official station set up yet to do these tutorial videos so I have to sit at my bathroom sink with a chair and my camera sitting on top of a shoebox <laughs> so you guys can see what's going on. Um, next I apply my Splurge Cream Shadow. This one is assertive and I just stick a little bit in the crease. Um, depending on the look you're going for you can pat it on which I do for the day um, or you can you know really pile it on there like on this eye for a stronger bolder look it blends right in you can rub it with your fingers you can use our cream eyeshadow brush and remember for your corners you kind of want to do like a little bit like a seven in your crease um i'm going to do each eye a little different just so you could kind of see 
the difference you get depending on the look you want. Um, bear with me. Okay, so I did one eye a little thicker than the other. Um, then what I do next is on the same eyeshadow palette, I get one of the, you know, a sparkly one. This one will work, the Smitten. Just going to put it at the very top. That helps kind of pop your, your eyes also. Um, if you want to get really fancy, say you're going out. Um, I like getting the cheeky and kind of putting a little bit here in the corner. You know, to kind of blend it in a little bit. Really add to that. Whoops, rubber band got stuck in there. <laughs> and my eyes are done. So all I have left is my mascara for my eyes. Um, I'm going to put on my second coat of my Stip up, Upper Lip Stain. And voila, my look is complete. I'm just going to throw on my mascara. I have already kept you for six minutes. So I will put my mascara on and let you go. And please ask me any questions. Um, if you want any of these looks, um, I would suggest going to the collections because you can really get the bang for your buck if you get a collection which comes with a little bit of everything. See you soon.